The latest version of the Genesis 1588 works very similar to the previous version, except the light is going to blink uh, constantly as it's regulating temperature. Whenever it's cycling, it's going to blink uh, constantly. Uh, you also have a day counter, and I'm going to demonstrate how to reset the day counter. To reset the day counter, if you'll notice this day counter, uh, it's been running a while, 72 days, and I want to reset that back to day one. By doing so, you press both buttons and hold them for about four seconds, and then the day counter will reset back to day one. Now, sometimes when you're incubating and you have a trusted thermometer, a thermometer that you've used in the past that you know is accurate, and it's a little off from what the screen temperature is reading. To recalibrate, you're gonna unplug the unit, Press and hold both buttons simultaneously. While you plug the unit back in, you want to hold these buttons for about four or five seconds. And you'll notice there's a C, that means calibration. If you notice, the thermometer in the incubator is reading 98.2 degrees. So we need to obviously bring that up 1.8 degrees. And by doing so, just press the temperature up button. And I've just raised the temperature up by 1.8 degrees. And now we just have to give it a few minutes to regulate. You'll notice the heat light did come on. So it's adding more temperature to the incubator. We're going to give it a few minutes. As you can see, after a few minutes, maybe three, four, five minutes, um, the 1588, the, will, it'll adjust. And the temperature now is uh, inside the incubator is going to line up with what's on the the LCD here. In order to advance to the next screen, hold both buttons for a few seconds and when you release it, you can actually calibrate your humidity here um, You know, if you, if you feel the need to do so. And then to advance beyond this screen, press and hold those buttons and when you release, just for a few seconds, and when you release, you're in the original, um, the original mode.